Marsden Hartley traveled to Europe in 1912, and he would be taken by Cubism as well as by Kandinsky. Now, he stays during the war and produces explorations of militarism, usually in somewhat abstract two-dimensional forms. Now, to look at this a little bit more closely, I want to look at portrait of a German officer. This depicts military honors, although these have a personal significance to Hartley. It actually refers to Hartley's lover at the time. His age at death and his regiment are both going to appear in the image. So we see his regiment here. We see his age at death. We also see a sense of synthetic cubism. The influence is quite clear in that the planar arrangements of the forms are developed on two-dimensional space. This is put together as if it were collage, as if he were putting together and pasting together pieces of paper, but in fact, he's creating very two-dimensional forms directly by hand on the canvas. The black background both brings colors out, but also depicts a sense of mourning or a funerary frame or shadow box, something we might expect to see at a funeral, remembering someone based on their life, their career, their accomplishments. So this is Hartley exploring not only sense of two-dimensionality in a compositional in compositional terms, he's exploring two-dimensionality, he's exploring the use of color, as well as kind of playing with those elements of synthetic cubism. But from a personal perspective, from the biographical context, he's also using this image to mourn the loss of his lover in combat. 